Hey everyone, it's Kelly with Kelly's Magical Realm. And today I'm doing a healing session. I'm doing a healing session for OCD, depression, anxiety, you know, and in this category, you can even say PTSD. So I have Archangel Raphael out. He's going to help us. He's the healing angel. I am a Reiki master. I'm also an angelic Reiki master. And I'm going to be doing a little bit of the angelic Reiki. I'll be using symbols on you. I'm going to be doing a lot of different healing modalities today. I'm actually work. I'm going to move the camera so you can see I'm working with a crystal grid. And the cool thing about the crystal grid is I set this up specifically for today's healing. So in the middle, I have a rose quartz. Now rose quartz is an amazing one to amplify your energy as far as love energy. So your heart. So this is great to really lift your vibration. And that's what we want to do because we don't want to stay in the state of stuck energy, depression, you know. So rose quartz is in the middle of my crystal grid. Another one I love is petrified wood. I have two pieces in this crystal grid. Petrified wood is amazing because it's very grounding, healing, it's nurturing. And petrified wood also... It basically helps you center and balance and to connect to your body. Because a lot of times, especially with PTSD, we have like out-of-body experiences. We don't feel connected to anybody or anything. This is to help you ground back in. So we have those two pieces. Also, I'm using smoky quartz. Smoky quartz is another good one for grounding. And smoky quartz also helps with depression and fear. And it can, and it'll help you um, also to get rid of negative energy. I used to wear this a lot as a necklace. So we have that. All the stones are nicely cleansed and cleaned. Also, I'm using two pieces of shungite. They're great for protection. You know, it helps with protection and also with, um, I forgot the name of it, like EMF or something, like the electricity in the place like it helps with that as well but it's really great to get rid of negative energy so we have that and the last crystal i'm using is an apache tear an apache tear is really good for transformation so to help you to kind of clear out everything it helps you remove blockages helps with fear it helps with grief too so we've got a lot going on but the great thing about crystal grids is this will amplify the energy. And since I set them up specifically to do a job, you know, they're each set in a certain way and it will amplify the Reiki. So what we're going to do, I'm going to start out, I'm going to spray you with some frankincense and myrrh. Nothing better than this. The, Jesus, his people, uh, what was it, the three amigos is um sorry I have a headache today but you know how the three wise men came in and they offered him presents and everything as a baby they had frankincense and myrrh but this is great so I'm going to use this it's actually going to go around your aura as protection so we're going to start with that and then I want you to relax and I want you to take a deep breath in through your nose and then out. We're going to do this two more times. So breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. And then one more time, breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. All right, and then one more thing I want to do. That we're going to use the AUM symbol. It's A-U-M. It was actually, they say that that's the word that created the universe, but there's nothing more healing than saying those words. Your words are so important, and they have the power to heal. 
That's why there's so many different things with sound healings, not just the vibration of equipment, but it's the vibration of your voice and what you say. So your words are very powerful and Aum is a very healing word. What we're going to do is I'm going to say Aum, I'm going to chant it, and you're going to picture it going from your root chakra all the way up to your crown, and that is going to release any blockages. So here we go. Um... And you can do this with me, or I can just do it. And you'll notice right away when you say those words or even listen to me as I'm saying them, you'll notice you have to be in the present moment. And once you get back into the present moment, that is when this fear, anxiety, and even the OCD will start to subside. It's all about getting grounded and in the present moment. So here we go again. Um... time um all right I don't know about you but I'm already feeling good <laughs> so one more thing before we get started I really want to use selenite selenite is probably one of the best crystals to have in your pocket if you can only have one because selenite is amazing about clearing out negative energies. I actually had a Reiki master years ago that would tell me whenever she went in houses to help people that had, you know, demons or evil spirits in their house, she would be, bring huge pieces of selenite. That was her main weapon. So this is so amazing and powerful. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cleanse you with selenite from your toes all the way up to your head and then all around your body with this. Only the highest love and light energy is allowed around you. Only the highest love and light energy can stay. All other energies must go away. And one more time, I'm gonna, now I'm going to bring it down. I'm going to bring it from your head all the way down to your feet. And then I'm going to bring our Tango Raphael back here. And I want to use my grounding sound bowl, my Tibetan sound bowl, because this will really help us get a little bit more grounded centered into this present moment so that we can relax, stay calm, and be here in the now. Let everything else just wash away. Let it all go. visual person, you can picture your roots going down from your chest, down, down past your hips, and then past your thighs, down your legs, past your knees, down to your feet, your feet chakras open up and then your roots are going down into the earth 
and then your roots go down to the center until they find a nice branch down there maybe a nice crystal that's embedded in the earth and your roots wrap around it and you're nice and secure and we call in our spirit guides our guardian angels please help guide us and heal us Archangel Raphael. Archangel Raphael, please be with us now. I invoke Archangel Raphael to work through me so I can heal you. And then I'm going to start right now with some Reiki. I'm going to do some symbols. You know, a great one that I'm going to use is actually called Sehe Ki. And Sehe Ki actually helps with addictions and that also would help with OCD. So we're gonna do this a few times. Sehe Ki, just by saying the word Sehe Ki invokes the meaning. I'm going to use the Master Reiki symbol, Daikumio. 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 It's the Master Healing symbol. symbol. The nice thing about Reiki is when you send it, obviously like the symbols and everything I'm doing, even the me sending the Reiki, it's going to work and get to you as long as you accept it. But it Reiki goes where it's needed and you can do it for even a few minutes and it's going to go right to where you need it. As long as you're accepting the healing, it will work. You're the one that really heals. You heal yourself. more symbols. All right, and I'm going to stop here. I'm going to use one more sound bowl. The power of sound is so healing and comforting. And this will help you get rest. You're going to sleep better tonight. It's very calming. You can watch this as many times as you need to. Highest love and light energies allowed around you 
only the highest love and light energy can stay. All other energies must go away. And so it is. Be blessed, everyone. Take care. Thank you for watching this. If anyone wants some healing, leave it in the comments below. I do have a business page on Facebook. It's called The Doors of Reiki, or you can reach out to me on here if you'd like any private healing. If not, just put in the comments what you thought of this. Thank you and take care.